All right, moving on to our core concept. A lot of good stuff in here. Okay, look at all these vocab words we're going to cover. So what a polynomial is, it's a monomial or a sum of monomials, so it could be more than one term. Um, each monomial is what we call a term. So if we see 5x right there for that binomial and 2, those are two separate terms. A polynomial with two terms is a binomial. A polynomial with three terms is what we call a trinomial, where there's three separate terms. Now, the degree of a polynomial is different than the degree of a monomial. And what the degree of a polynomial is, is it's the greatest degree of the term, so it's the highest exponent is what we're looking for. Um, a polynomial in one variable is in standard form when the exponents from left to right, when they're the biggest on the left, smallest on the right. So we're going to rewrite these in standard form. Um, and then when we have the coefficient of the first term is what we call the leading coefficient, and that's the number out front of the highest exponent. All right, let's do an example here. So they say first write it in standard form. Okay, so what we know is we need the highest exponent first, and then we're going to go from greatest to least as we go. So we see that x to the third, keep the negative with it. Okay, that's attached. Negative x to the third. We're going to write that first. Then we're going to look for an x squared. Well, we don't have an x squared, so we're going to move on to that 15x. So plus 15x, and then plus 3. Okay, this is in standard form because the highest exponent is to the left, and we go down from left to right. Now it says identify the degree. Now remember, degree of a monomial, is, or sorry, a polynomial is a little different than a monomial. Um, we just look for the highest exponent. Okay, we see our highest exponent here is a third, so our degree is going to be three, and the leading coefficient. That's the number out front of our highest exponent of our greatest exponent. So it's very the number out front in standard form. We see is a negative one. Okay, so our leading coefficient is going to be negative 1. So we have three things there. We wrote it in standard form, found the degree, which is the highest exponent, and the leading coefficient is the number out front of basically our degree. Okay, a couple more examples here. Write them in standard form. Well, let's look at A. There's only one term, so that's what we call a monomial, so we can't really rewrite it. Um, the degree, highest exponent, we see the degree is 4. And then the leading coefficient, um, actually they don't even ask us for the leading coefficient here. Um, if they did, it would be a negative 3. And then it says classify each by the number of terms. One term, we call that a monomial. Mo mono meaning one, monomial. All right, B, write it in standard form. Okay, so standard form, remember exponents from greatest to least. So we're going to put the 5x squared up first, and then minus x, and plus Four. Make sure we keep those negatives with our variables. Okay, that, that's going to be a little tricky there. Um, identify the degree. Well, squared is our highest exponent, so our degree is going to be 2. And it's a trinomial because there are three terms. Trinomial. And the last one here, write it in standard form. So we only have two terms. This is what we call a binomial. Um, we see q to the fifth power, so we're going to write that first. And then we're going to go down from there. Well, the next highest is the first exponent. Okay, so we're going to write 8q. Now, um, identify the degree. See, the highest exponent is 5, so our degree is 5. And classify each polynomial by the number of terms. We see there's 2, so it's what we call a binomial.